Welcome back everyone. It is Monday, June 22nd and it is the first week of summer vacation for our students and it is the last week of school for the teachers. We would like to acknowledge that we're on Treaty 6 territory in the traditional homeland of the Métis Nation. These are the meeting grounds, gathering place and traveling route to the Cree, Nakota Sioux, Dene, Salto, Blackfoot and Métis. We acknowledge all of the many First Nations, Métis and Inuit whose footsteps have marked the lands for centuries. We want to thank all of our staff, the students, and the families for all the hard work that they have put in over the last three and a half months. We know that alternative learning was not easy and that all of us had to learn some very new skills in a very short amount of time, but we are so incredibly proud of every one of you. You have done an amazing job. While all of our students are now relaxing at home and enjoying summer vacation, we welcome back our teachers and staff to school today. And they're busy working on report cards and setting up your classrooms for our return in September. If you borrowed a Chromebook from the school, please make sure to return it Monday between 9.30 and 11.30 or 2 to 4, Tuesday 2 to 4, or Wednesday from 9.30 to 11.30. Chromebooks need to be returned charged and staff will be at the front doors ready to accept them. Please remember to follow all social distancing rules when you come to return the Chromebooks. Do you still have any library books at home or textbooks? If so, you can return them anytime this week in the big, big brown bin outside of the front doors. And we'll also have Lost and Found out there on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday afternoons if you have anything left over. And if you had any school supplies left out, they will be outside all week long and you can come and pick those up as well. And we have some new staff to announce that are coming to Woodbridge Farms for the next school year. So watch this really quick slideshow to see who they are. We have a number of fun theme days this week for our last week of school. So yesterday was National Selfie Day, so please make sure you send in a picture of your most favorite or silliest selfie. And we will also be celebrating National Pink Day on Tuesday and Beach Day on Friday. So send in those pictures and videos of you celebrating our theme days and send them to WBFTV1 at gmail.com for your chance to be featured on our last episode of WBFTV next Monday. Don't forget to stay tuned until the end of this episode to check out the pictures from last week's theme day. I think one of our favorites might have been National Root Beer Day because those root beer floats were delicious. Agreed. Our quiz questions this week all have to do with ice cream. So, which flavors are included in Neapolitan ice cream? Is it A, orange, vanilla, and chocolate? B, strawberry, chocolate, and vanilla? Or C, raspberry, vanilla, and caramel. Oh, it's my turn? Sorry, I was thinking about ice cream. Our next question is, what is the most popular flavor of ice cream? Is it A, strawberry, B, chocolate, or C, vanilla? All of them are good. And our last one is approximately how many licks does it take to finish a single scoop of ice cream? Is it A, 50, B, 100, C, 150, or D, 200? And this week's challenge that we want you to vote on, would you like to see us compete in a hands-free watermelon slice eating competition or a watermelon seed spitting con competition. Both sound fun. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us today. We hope you have a marvelous Monday and a fantastic first week of summer vacation. We'll be back on Thursday with another episode of WBFTV. It's probably going to be our last before the summer. And we'll have some special guests with some messages for all of you. So make sure you check it out. And don't forget to send in any pictures you have of you celebrating theme days this week to WBFTV1 at gmail.com. And we will see you on Thursday.